it's not right to waste things. A robot that wastes things can never be perfect, you know. Who cares? I don't want to be perfect anyway. But, Bark? I know I'm a good-for-nothing robot. Here, look. But that's what I have been telling you, Buck. You must have yourself checked. No way. I'd sooner die than to let anyone touch me, except my dad. Listen, Buck. Your dad, I mean Professor Terrapin, won't be back here for a while, so... So you... what? I can wait until Dad comes back. I'm not a perfect robot, but that doesn't bother me. All right, I'll show you that I'm powerful enough. Uh, Buck, where are you going? shaped like a cross. It's very strange that it should have formed like that. There's a vein of uranium under the island, and about 10,000 robots work there. 10,000 robots? Wow! Yes, because only robots can work deep in the ocean. The robots excavate uranium and then refine it as well here in the factory. There's also a school here. Oh, really? Yes, it's a training school for robots. It's excellent, one of the best in the world. Our robots are all good engineers. They can handle any problem, structural, design, anything. I'm very impressed. This is our computer room, the latest equipment. So it's the heart of Cross Island. Oh, it's amazing. Professor Terrapin is a superb scientist, and his robots are a great success. Some of us are more inspired than others, I'm afraid. But Professor Terrapin was... Oh! Fuck! Stop bothering everybody and go back to the classroom right away. Huh? Somebody please go get him. I will. Hey, who are you? Astro. Astro, huh? You come to take me back to the class? Well, I... If you think I'm going back without a fight, you're crazy. Listen, I just... I won't go. Your attention, please. An urgent message. A small volcano has just erupted at point 103. We've already suffered considerable damage to robots and equipment. Attention. Alert the lobster rescue squad. going to do it's now or never I'll show everyone that I'm powerful enough this is my chance to be a hero
carry the injured robots to the robot hospital. from prison? I had no idea he was in jail. Yes. Mm, and where is he now? He and another prisoner dove from the cliff into the ocean. So far, we haven't found any trace of them. Either they drowned or are still at large. Have you told Buck? No, not until we get more news. Buck will be crushed. He worshipped the professor. Unfortunately, Professor Terrapin hasn't completed Buck yet. If Terrapin dies, we may have to scrap Buck. This is the secret path. It will take us to Cross Island. It was a lot of trouble, but it was worth it. <laughs> One of Professor Terrapin's ancestors was a master spy. They say he had a thousand different faces. How can you have a thousand faces? <laughs> he had a special secret, the secret to a transformation process. The knowledge passed down to Professor Terrapin, and he tried to create Buck as a transformation robot. Transformation robot? Yes, a robot that can change itself into many different things. Professor Terrapin worked on Cross Island building robot workers, and he tried to make a transformation robot in secret. Thus, Buck was born. Buck was Professor Terrapin's life work, and his beloved son as well. But this work required a lot of money, and he embezzled public funds from robot workers. His ambition turned him into a criminal, and he was put in jail. So that's why Buck isn't finished yet, huh? Yes, it's like he's somewhere between life and death. Hello. This is my ship. Have you ever heard of a famous scientist named Mandrake? <laughs> he was my father's father's father. <laughs> I have one simple rule in life. To get everything I want. Right now, I want to get all the uranium in Cross Island. And I'm going to follow my rule. <laughs> is that you, Snare? Yes, boss. How's the job going? I got Terrapin out of prison and managed to sneak him back onto Cross Island. All right, now go and make sure all the other arrangements have been taken care of. Yes, sir, boss. Get ready, men. Now for some fun. <laughs> Buck? It's me, Buck. Daddy? Yes, it's me. I'm home. Daddy? Buck! Dad! Buck, it's wonderful to see you. I can't believe it's really you. Buck. Who's that, Dad? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, he's just a friend of mine. He is the man who helped me get out of prison.
And these two are the bots who assisted us in our escape. Come, Buck. I'm going to complete you, and you'll be the robot I meant you to be. It's the only reason I came back. Really? got enough parts now. All the main components are already in Buck's body. All I have to do is rearrange them. I'm the only one who can finish the job. Now, for the man-made skin. Perfect. It's just perfect. Hurry up. We don't have much time. Calm down. This is the most critical moment. Yes, I have, Buck. You're a perfect transformation robot now. The most advanced in the world. You've got ultra powers, Buck. No one can stop you. Why don't you show my friend here what you can do? No, no. No need for that. I'll take your word for it. Come on. You want to know what he can do for you, don't you? Sure. But you better be on the level or else you'll be in big trouble. a good job, Buck, but you need a lot more practice. Did I change into a lion, Dad? Did I really change into a lion? Yes, you did it perfectly. Thank you, Daddy. <sighs> but you shouldn't have scared me. That robot of yours is a monster. You shut up. Okay, okay. Now, Professor, you know what you're supposed to do next. Just make sure you don't fail at that. What's the matter, Dad? Buck? Do me a big favor, will you? Oh, sure. What do you want me to do, Dad? Well, I'd like to repay this man for helping me. I want you to go to the warehouse. What warehouse? The uranium warehouse. Listen, Buck, we want you to go to the uranium warehouse and turn the switch on to open the door. What for? All you have to do is turn the switch on. What are you going to do, Dad? We're going to test you, that's all. Test me? Many guards are on the watch there. If you sneak in and turn the switch on, you'll pass the test. I'll be very proud of you. All right, Dad. Don't go, Buck. It's a trick. Ah! Who's this? I don't know. I'm an expert at making robots, but I don't know this one. Look, he has great powers. I wonder who created him. Don't use Buck for your crimes. He loves you. Look, what's that? A dog. A robot dog, huh? I didn't know there was a robot dog here, though. Neither did I. Must be a watchdog or something like that. All right, dog. Go home. Hey, where are you going? Hey, come back. Let's go get that dog. All right. Hey. Hey, hey dog, stop. Hey, let's go. Oh, oh, oh let's go. Let's go. Ah! 
Who's there? I'm Mandrake the Fourth. I'm Snare's boss. What? I ordered him to arrange for your escape from prison. And you're going to open the door to the uranium warehouse for him as your part of the deal. I made no deal with you. I want all the uranium on Cross Island, and you will get it for me. I know you, Mandrake. You're the boss of a smuggling gang. I won't help you. Professor Tervin, I'm used to getting everything I want. It has become a habit. So that's why you wanted me to complete Buck, to help you steal. That's right. I need his help. Buck must have opened the door to the warehouse by now. The uranium is ours. Goodbye. No, you can't use Buck like this. I'll get even with you if it's the last thing I do. Hide him somewhere, Snare. Yes, boss. <laughs> Dad? Hey, where's Dad? It's urgent, Buck. You have to save your dad. He's been kidnapped. Kidnapped? Yes, a robot with horns on his head like this. Astro? Astro? I can't believe it. He wouldn't. Go save your dad, Buck. Hey, where'd they go? The robot carried your dad to the warehouse. All right, I'll go get him. Want some help? <laughs> I must save Dad right away. Those crooks took Buck with them. Save my son, please. They've gone to the uranium warehouse. They're using Buck to steal. <gasps> Professor! Professor Terrapin! Since when did you get here? Buck, you're here. Who shot you, Dad? The crooks you took to the warehouse. They were just using both of us. Buck, you've got to save Cross Island. Oh, Dad! Go get them. They're in the warehouse. Buck, let's go! They're getting away, and they've stolen all the uranium. Uranium? Hop on my back, Astro. Let's go after them. Here they are. Inferno reporting. My new Aqua Jet Pack is functioning perfectly.
Nobody can fix me. Are you still going to be my friend? Of course I am. Even if I'm good for nothing? Come on, Buck. Don't be silly. Hey, you're still a very special robot. Actually, you should know. A little while back, I was doing some reconnaissance, and I scanned the room where all the criminals were, and I discovered that Voltex was scanning Buck, and he must have sent a copy of his robotic structure, and he sent it to someone. And whoever Voltex sent it to now knows how Buck was able to shapeshift. But don't worry, we'll find them. <laughs> 